So back in our user service, I'm going to go down the constructor and then I'm going to define our first function. In that case, it's the get users. And remember, it doesn't take any parameter and it returns an observable of user array. So now we're going to pass user array. Now we haven't defined this user type yet. And later we're going to define an interface to represent the type of data that we're requesting. But for now, let's go ahead and finish the function. So here I'm going to call the HTTP. So I'm going to do return this HTTP and then I'm going to call the get on it. As you can see here, we have the delete, get, head, uh, JSON options, and we're going to look at those later. And then we also have the put. So for now, we're going to use the get request because we're trying to make a request to some API to retrieve data. And then we have to pass in the URL where this data leaves. And this is going to be the JSON placeholder. So here I can just pass in the URL for JSON placeholder, and then that's going to go to slash users. So this is our first function. And don't forget to pass in the type as well for the get. So here we're going to pass in the type. And then let's go ahead and define our second function. So I'm going to copy the first one go down a little bit and this is supposed to be get users and this is get user this is going to return one user and i'm going to remove the bracket and pass in the id here let's say in this case we're going to pass in one so now what we need to do is to define this user here so that we can map this data properly 